I'm sturdy like a milli rocket. Skin clear, still look your Andy Miller knockers. Money in my pocket. Don't call me a money pocket engine. Today I'll be installing my A. PR performance GT500 front splitter using the lower part of my the little bit lip that we have on the bumper right now as from what I can tell these are uh, these are going to be spacers that we're going to stick underneath from here to here using the rods right here sticking all the way through as the new hardware and then we also have to mount this so up to the front from the front up to the crash bar we got to drill little holes up here so I'm gonna break this all down, read through the manual, figure out what we gotta do exactly, and set this up in an area where I can cut it and make sure that we have it all ready. There is an even amount on both sides. Sit where this is gonna sit. There's a little bit of ledge right there. As you can tell, there's a little bit of ledge right there. It, this is how far it is gonna come out. Move it right here, and then I'm gonna mark the holes through down on all the 12 different points, which we will be using as mounting points. Do 50 millimeters, I can tell these are a little bit smaller. These are the ones that we're gonna be using at the very end, but all the other ones we're gonna be using down in the middle. These spacers, I'm pretty sure, are gonna be used or in between them. And different places where I'm gonna be drilling through this bumper with a one inch drill bit, real quick. I'm gonna puncture that out, I'll come right back, and then we'll be able to install using the hardware mounting through the bottom and the spacer for the t all the longer bolts. So, I'm gonna get that done and then I'll be right back. Touch on the craftsmanship of this. Look at the APR, the little badge right here. I mean, they do definitely have high quality performance stuff. I did drill my very first hole, as you can see. It's not drilled all the way through, but I did get to where it is gonna be. Couple holes now. It doesn't get easier drilling into carbon fiber. It just looks so clean and pristine, and I wanted to keep stay that way. I kind of wish they pre-drilled these, but I'm getting the job done. It's not, as you can see, it's not a perfect hole. This one is actually one of the worst ones, but like for this one, for example, just the hole. There's some weaving on the very bottom, but that's fine. As you can see, the 12 different holes. They came out pretty smooth, and the inside there's a little bit more fibers on like the lower part of them. But besides that. It's all gonna get covered up underneath anyways with the bolts, so we're gonna get this out. Wipe it down just a little bit. It did get a lot of dust on it, but and so did I. But we're gonna wipe it down and then we're gonna line it up to the bottom part of the splitter. Cool part about this is when I lift this up, it stays in. The drill the holes were drilled perfectly, that way it can actually really line up and really stick inside of these holes. I mean if you look at it, the holes like the same size as the bolt. So now it is time to, with this, put this over, line it up, and then get the holes fitted. I'm gonna add the spacers on everything except for the end ones. These are half inch spacers, by the way. I went to the hardware store real quick. I got the hardware I need. Now all I'm gonna do is loosely attach this onto here. I do still have to have the bumper, uh, drill this in through the bumper as well. But for now, I'm just gonna loosely attach these. I wanna see how they line up and then also just to uh, keep the hardware on the bolt so I don't lose it in the meantime. Instead of little metal pieces, I can, I can see there used to be clips that go over here. Instead, I'm gonna use this hardware, which I've picked up. I'm gonna put set this over the actual bottom splitter, line it up, and then actually mount this onto this right now. Then we're gonna be able to set this against and then with the splitter rods, be able to figure out where we're gonna mount it in the front up to the actual crash bar. So I'm gonna show you once I get this all hooked up and screwed on. itself it looks incredible and the build quality of this it is fully mounted to the bumper if i shake this it's shaking the bumper not this it's as you see as i hit it it's 100 mounted 
I've made sure to hard mount this even into the middle of the car as well. So it is stuck on there. It is even on both sides and it just looks so aggressive from the front. That carbon weave really shines through. If you can see that right there. Looks sick. I'm really loving how this front end has came out so far. So anyways, that'll be it for today. Please, if you guys haven't already subscribed, I have 70% of my viewers unsubscribed. So please hit that subscribe button. We got a lot more things to come. We got carbon right there. We got carbon on my doors. We got carbon everywhere. This is going to be a sick car. Can't wait for you guys to see the entire build. So appreciate it. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Okay, so this is probably going to sound stupid for me to say, but I just had a moment when I'm looking at this car and I just realized how fortunate I am to own this car. I've always seen cool cars drive around and always this particularly Mustangs caught my attention. And now to have the privilege to own my own, I just want to let you know, guys know that it is possible and that if anything you guys want in life, you guys can put your mind to it, whether that is a house, an apartment, college, school, or owning a car like this. I know you guys can do it. It is all about the mindset and I firmly, genuinely do believe in uh, manifestation. Put it into the comments description what you guys would like to achieve, and I'd like to see when you guys come back and do achieve it. Comment. Let me guys know. M manifestation is all about the mind. So put it out into the world, and hopefully the world can get back to you. Anyways, guys, that's going to be the end of today's video. I appreciate you guys watching. Please hit that slow motion. Come stay the night. We can stay until it's bright. In the morning, got the top open. Come take a ride.